You dullard. You dullard. You dullard. You dullard. Yo, what's up, YouTube? Thanks for clicking on the video. I'm just showing off the timeline on how to get around Yushiro's DP with every character possible. Let's get into it. Like the video if you like it. Comment anything I left out. And subscribe to join the mystery game. You know you want to. Let's go. You know what? One thing before we get into the DPs. Yushiro's tilt demon skill. When Lady Tamiyo comes out and puts you to sleep, all you have to do is be in the air. So when you see her come out, you can jump at the last second or do anything that will get you in the air at the last second. And you'll fall. He cannot hit confirm. All right, now to the DPs. With all these DPs, you're gonna wanna make sure you're not mashing so you can do the DP as quick as possible. So for Nosuke specifically, you wanna wait till he's just about done doing his DP. You're still gonna take some damage with Nosuke because Nosuke doesn't evade, he just tanks through everything. And with Zenitsu, you wanna wait till the last possible second that you can react. If you do it too early, Yushiro will dodge your air spin and hit you right after that. Now HK Tanjiro, he don't call me Tanjiro. You wanna wait a while as well, but you don't have to wait till the very last second. As soon as you see him flipping and about to attack, if you can react that fast, then you can do it. Now Goku's is one of the easiest to pull off. Soon as you see Yushiro dodge, you can do your DP. You really don't have to have much timing for this one. Now Nezuko's is very crucial that you wait to the last moment or you'll clash with Yushiro. And you know, that's fine for some people if you don't want to go for the punish, but if you want to go for the punish, you're going to want to wait to the very last second possible. Now Urukodaki is just impossible. You have to pair Yushiro. That's the only way for Urukodaki. My girl Makomo's DP also can't compete with Yushiro. Sabito's DP works great. It's easy to execute, but the later you wait, the more damage you're going to get for the punish. Now I know, I know, I know, y'all gonna be mad at this next one, cause it's, this is everyone's favorite character, everybody uses him, but Marada, his DP is completely useless, going up against Yushiro's. Now Shinobu's, you have to time correctly just to break even, just to dodge it, you can't punish. So you're gonna probably need some practice for this, not, not too much practice, but you wanna do it right before Yushiro lands back on his feet. Now let's go to an easy one, Rui's is pretty easy, you can do it Pretty much whenever you see Yushiro do the dodge. Now Akaza's DP versus Yushiro's DP, that's when it gets pretty tricky. You want to delay it and wait a while a little bit. If you do it too early, it'll have no effect and Yushiro recovers before you. So you either have to block or use your demon ball to escape. So you want to wait a second before you use your DP when you see him dodge. Next is Yahaba. His is completely and utterly useless. It may can stop a mid combo since the arrows stay there, but it can't stop the DP at all. Now, Susamaru, you have to charge her DP for it to connect, or else Yushiro's gonna win. So make sure you charge her DP. Now, Enemu isn't really too hard, you just wanna hesitate for a split second. Now, for the last character before we end this video, which is Yushiro. For Yushiro to escape Yushiro's DP, you can either do the tilt triangle or you can either do your DP. But it's probably going to be an endless loop if you do your DP. Depending on you and your opponent, of course. But since Yushiro's DP acts as a parry, you want to wait until the other Yushiro is about to attack you. Then you want to hold your DP. Well, that's going to wrap today's video up. I really appreciate y'all for checking in. Like, comment, subscribe. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I hope y'all learned something. If I missed something, please let me know in the comments down below. And y'all do me a favor. Y'all support me. Go ahead and follow my social media that's in the outro. I'm trying to get that up and running in the next few months. I'm out.